going on, you PKers? How are you? Or should I say, Happy Sublimation Day? There's a reason to this. You see, I actually got some things, or hope I got some things, for um, my new coasters. Okay, I'll show you what the coasters look like. I'll find them and I'll come back. Pause. Two thousand years later. Okay, so guys, um, other than me practically shouting at the screen, kind of like uh, y y you know when Billy Mays used to do it before he died. He was just like, "Hi, this is Billy Mays here, and I'm going to sell you everything on the planet." Hi, Billy Mays here for the best deal on the original Zorbies, the most absorbent material I've ever used. You could go over the hood, the roof, and the trunk of your car before you have to wring them out. Coffee, tea, milk or wine, it doesn't matter. It picks it up just like a vacuum. Yeah, I really like Billy Mays. Anyways, um, so I got, I bought a stack of these they're called cricket uh, coasters they're no different than regular coasters except for their ceramic see they're shiny on one side like this well except for this one right here but that's got a little foam pad covering it I can easily take that off and then it's it too is shiny as well but anyways, um, yeah, I got four of these, and I would like to, oh, and by the way, the backs are dull, like this. Anyways, you understand. Um, so, the front's got shine, the back doesn't, but I got some tools, and I, I'm probably going to put this video in my building video, because it technically, well, building slash creativity video because technically speaking that's what it is it's creating something and I think possibly at the end of this video if everything works out I can actually show you guys a finished coaster so that's also the reason why I would put in a building slash creative video I may put in my building tool but I also would like to or my tool and build, but I also would like to, and that that would be the name of my channel. And I'll probably put that down in the link down below if it's not already on the channel. But then I'll put in the link on my other video, my main um, collection, which would be the Robley PK. So. I'll start adding links to things. So yes, my Robley PK will, will start getting a lot of links. So instead of just being like, oh, you can you can link to this, I'll be like, you can link to this and this and this and this and this. So yeah, you guys are going to get a lot of links. Anyways, that's beside the point. So I'm going to do these with actual pictures on the front using my uh, sublimation printer and my heat press and ceramic actually can hold quite a bit of heat but it doesn't go without saying that since they're ceramic the heat heats them up so I have to have something to calm that down okay I do have heat tape that I did buy on Amazon link will be down below definitely if any of you guys want it but like I said it's going to be in the, the crafting channel so I'll have to figure that out but that's beside the point and I'm not going to unbox that or unwrap that open it whatever you want to call it because it's it's basically fancy tape heat tape is it's lesser sticky tape the reason why it's lesser sticky is because then you can pull it off of the objects also it's it's heat resistant so that means up to a certain point it actually resists heat so 
it won't burn while things are, are on top of it. So it should be fine if you put it on coasters or if you put it on other things while it's in the heat press. Enough dilly-dallying. I want to see what's inside here. That is not what I thought it was going to be. Okay then. Yeah, um, this might actually go on the back of the coasters as well. Because oddly enough, I thought that they were going to be um, magnetic or at least have magnets on the back of them. So you could put the magnets on the back of corkboard or just on the back of the coasters in general. Maybe I'd give that as a customization option or just put them in the package in general so people could choose if they wanted magnets or not. Because then they, they could have their, their pictures of whatever, their family members, dogs, whatever, um, squirrels, you name it, on the coaster. So it'd be like a mini picture frame circular mind you but it'd be a, mi a mini picture frame and then it'd have a cork board on the back of it so you could actually use it as a coaster but if you didn't want to you could take the magnet and you could stick it on your fridge and you'd have good old grandpa herbert or good old grandma josephine i don't know i just pulled those names from the air on on your refrigerator or you'd have your dog spot or your cat I, I don't know Robert <laughs> on your fridge as well again pulled those names from random midair so yeah um, so even though that's not what I thought it was going to be because I was hoping to get the heat resistant gloves. We'll try this one out. See if this one does it. Oh, that looks a little bit more prompt. Yep, yep. Okay. So, that was a false alarm. This is what I was looking for. These are heat resistant gloves. These will be my bread and butter for anything that's hot from here on out. Obviously, they, they do wear down over time, but I think they said that they're good up to 1,470 degrees. So these are like professional gloves. So hopefully everything works out well and I can keep these for a good long time. So if, if my business starts growing like out of control kind of thing, I can just keep up with the coasters and keep up with you know, other, like, I don't know, sublimating on tiles or something like that. Actually, I'm going to show you guys what these things look like. Oh, they just fall out of the package. Okay. Oh my gosh, these are heavy. Guys, these are heavy. These are really heavy. Holy moly. These are thick, too. Holy mother! Some thick gloves! It's got a little thread inside there. Oh, I like these. Yeah, the little thread inside there kind of bothers me a little bit. But I think it'll be okay. We got a little flames on there. And there's little flames on the back. And it says Com Smart, which obviously you can read because it's not a name or anything like that it's got stuff on the outside right here like these little skids things I think that's just so you can grip whatever it is because it because it kind of resembles you know like those uh, little decals that you can put on the bathtub um, so you can stand up and stuff like that I you know what went if you're if you're standing up in the bathtub or in the shower I should say whilst you're taking your shower kind of thing those little decals that you can put on your, your floor that that have extra grips on them yeah those things 
this kind of resembles the same thing but as you can tell it's not easy for me to pull my hands away from each other the reason for that is because the grips provide a resistance and you know it's good to have that because otherwise you know if the heated items that you were taking out you know just slipped out of your hands they could burn you and it's not a good thing so yeah So yeah, this was, this video is enjoyable. It's it's a little bit longer than I had thought it would be, but it's not that bad. It's it's only about 13 minutes right now. But yeah, um, so uh, I will give you a link to everything that was in this video, even though there was three things, and I didn't want there to be three things, but I'm actually glad there was, because then I can kind of show you a conglomeration of what all makes up the um the uh coasters coasters yes what all is going to be in the coaster packages or the coaster kits that that you guys can get if you uh buy coasters from me and yes i will be selling them um so i'll try at the end of this video if it's not too long to show you a coaster if not I will definitely put my website down there for my merch and you can definitely check that out and I will have my coasters on there there will be a display thing but you can go by the display and you can create your own custom designs there's a lot of customization that can happen through there but yeah I'll leave that to you guys, and I'll try to um, post another short video of wh what the coasters look like um, after I get them out of the heat press, but obviously now they're not, so I'll have to do that a little bit later on. But yeah, other than that, um, I'm just about done with my stuff. If you guys want to leave a comment down in the com down in the comment section down below that would be more than appreciated if you'd like to like the video give it a thumbs up that would be wonderful or you can subscribe I'll leave the instructions up there and make sure to click that notifications bell always click it and click all afterwards and you'll get any future notifications from me about any possible videos I have whether it's from the Robley PK channel or any of my other channels for future reference but yeah again I'll leave those links down in the um, description below just for future reference so keep on looking down there and other than that it's all golden you're all golden so I'll catch all you dudes and dudettes on the flip side. See you later. Bye.